We got the Yeezys, and it was 50% off. Let's go ahead and jump into these sneaks. What's good? What's cracking? What's happening? It's your boy Moves the Alpha, and today we are back to talk about the Yeezy sale that's going on. The fifty percent off, and yes, we grabbed some pairs. I got a little bit of his and hers going on uh, with the four fifties. Grabbed some of the seven hundreds, and I also grabbed a pair of the Quantums. But yes, man, we're about to take a look at, uh, at this. Um, talk about this sale that's going on. It's crazy, easy sale, the easy um, day that's been more like two weeks of easy dropping. And you know, we're about to see what I got, man. So let's go ahead and jump into this. All right, all right, all right. So the first shoe that we're going to um, take a peek at today is the Easy Boost 450. And I did get these for me and my beautiful, beautiful fiance. Um, so this is the flat colorway. Let's go ahead and grab these going up out of here. I have seen these too, by the way. If you follow me on Twitter, you know that I, I put close to my singer that they come in. So before I even get into the first sneaker, make sure you stop right now and follow me on Twitter at Moves the Alpha M O Z underscore T H E A L P H A. But now that I'm done plugging myself, yes, man. So this is the Easy Boo 450, and I believe these are called the Flax colorway, like a flax. I don't even know what that means, but yeah, it's like this grayish tan. And um, this sneaker is kind of crazy. I always used to say like, yo, I can't see why people are paying for that. Um, and like I said, I think it was like innovative, but I just never was gonna pay 210 to have a pair of these. But when they went on sale for 105, I'm like, all right, that looks pretty decent. I always wanted to try the sneaker and it's something that I can, you know, kind of match with uh, the missus. So I went ahead and got us both. So I was getting hers out the box. So I ended up getting us both a pair um, for us to match in these. But yeah, I think, I mean, I haven't tried this on. I probably should try to shoe on and let, you know what I'm saying, and see like what the comfort is hitting for. But, I mean, I think it's just a cool, innovative sneaker. And like I say, man, for 105 bucks, you can't complain. Uh, like I said, it's just like a flax everything. So the laces, they have like nice little, um, you know, aglets on there that's kind of like that brownish black. The whole shoe is in flax. On the bottom there, you see it has that Adidas in the top corner. Um, no other branding really on the sneaker besides that little uh, bit of Adidas on the insole. I don't even know if the camera will be able to pick it up inside of it. It does say like Yeezy inside of there um, with the little globe. Has my size on there. I always did. Um, well, I guess not always, but I learned really quick in the first pair that I purchased wrong that always go half size up. So, yes, this is the Flax. Looking forward to wearing this. It's probably going to be a comfy sneaker. I'm not going to have them sitting up there like I do with some of the other Yeezys that I haven't even put on yet. But, yeah, man, really good pickup at 105 bucks, 50% off. You can't complain about it. Pack touchdown. All right, yeah, so next sneaker that we got is the Yeezy uh, 700, and these are the Geodes. Um, here, let me unbox these back ladies as well, too. So when I actually saw this shoe, once again, oops, sorry for that sound, but yeah, when I saw this shoe online, I thought this was more like gray. I don't, I don't even know if y'all can see it, but like it's more like a purplish blue, and I genuinely thought this was like an all gray over shoe with a nice little great writing through there um it's not bad i have a pair of 700 b3s the copper that i put on the channel before on um, that are sitting back there i haven't worn them yet but yeah i mean looking at this shoe given out the box it definitely feels like really sturdy um like i said i'll give y'all like a nice little 360 up at the bottom um it's like this deep black i don't know it's something about that has like a little purplish chin as well followed by these little accents right there on the toe box that are black as well this lacing system has like these little I don't even know what you call that over the top of like where the aglet should be. So, I mean, you don't have to worry about every time your shoes and these damn leaves already be laced for you. Let me take the inserts out. Nothing special about those. And then you can also see that easy branding inside of the um, inside there, which the cushion does feel really decent on the inside. And that's why I bought these. It's like, you know, I'll have some, maybe like some, some straight leg cargos or something like that that I can wear you and I'll be able to pull it off. Because it's like that, I don't even know how to describe it. It's like a neoprene, like net. It's not really off material you can see like the shoelace uh, mechanism going through the size on these but i mean really decent shoe like i said a shoe that if it was at full price what i purchased it no but at 50 percent um i went ahead and pulled the trigger but i mean let me know right now i feel like this is a good part actually like did you pick anything up from the 50 percent sale um are you still more like no kanye said don't wear it so i'm not gonna wear it and put it in my collection i don't know i don't care about all of that i feel like this is just a good time for sneaker lovers if you're not really riding with the hype that I mean, 
you can purchase sneakers that, you know, a couple of years ago, people would have been like, you know, dying over, I wouldn't say necessarily dying, but, you know, going crazy for, you know, why not be able to pick them up now and just add them into the collection I have. So you have an easy 700 in the Geo colorway, pretty decent. Can't wait to actually put an outfit together on there. Oh, I forgot, this is another one of those simple branding with the Adidas on the bottom for the um, Adidas logo on the, on the bottom patch there. And, just that 700 going across the side, inside medial shoes, nothing. And like I say, just that nice puffy, thick tongue. So looking forward to rocking it. And the last sneaker we got is the Yeezy Quantum. This is um, Yeezy basketball sneaker. And we got them in the Miss Slate colorway. Also, once again, for 50% off, if you don't make these, man, make these boxes good enough to open, like with a little sliding mechanism on camera, trying to be all cool. But yes, man, you see the sneaker, uh, here it goes. This is definitely something a little different, but the reason I actually like this sneaker is the same reason that I like the um, Adidas Pure God that I raved about so much. Like it just looked different and I can definitely see where they kind of took some of what they did here and put it on the AE1 and I really like that AE1. So I'm kind of disappointed about what I've been seeing in the AE2. I hope those mock-ups and those drafts are not real because I don't know, that's just like a complete 180 from how good the AE1 is. But we're not here to talk about that sneaker. Yes, we were talking about the Miss Slate, um, the Easy Quantums. And yeah, man, it's just like a nice tan all over the sneaker. Um, you know, guys, like this nice little wave material. This is like a, I don't know even know how it says, like a heart cloth. And you got like that see-through um, kind of mesh going on there with this nice, thick, rubbery filling sole. The bottoms have like that translucent yellow, like milky going on with the red under. You do get that easy boost still there. I don't know if you can see it or me pushing that in the camera. Um, followed by the black hits for the tongue. And it feels like this is like all connected in a way too. It's like, yeah, outside of there. On the inside as well. You don't have that world anymore, but I don't know if the camera can pick it up inside of there. It just says the Adidas sign with the Yeezy, so there is no world, at least from what I can see on the back end like the others. Um, but yeah, this is just a cool shoe. Now this, I actually don't know what I'm gonna wear with these. Um, I probably will end up wearing these. It's not like something that's gonna be crazy. I wanna keep my eyes for the value in the future, but I think it's just gonna take a nice little outfit. I'm probably gonna end up wearing all gray, probably an Adidas track suit. I don't know why I'm even thinking in my head I was gonna try to find a fit or anything, but I might be able to pull off maybe like, like a Fear of God um, sweatshirt bottom set to go with this. But yeah, once again, you have quick um, little hits of Adidas on the bottom. Don't know if you can pick it up there. And I'm checking them out. I don't see any other branding realistically on this sneaker and i think that was something crazy about the line it was like you know Yeezy just had such a look to where you didn't need a lot of branding you could just look like oh you have to wear a pair of Yeezys, which is so funny how like a shoe can be so iconic or just a a whole brand can be so iconic for so many years and then finally it's like now when people can finally get them for 50 percent off or they're sitting they just go to show you that people weren't going to buy it unless it's really limited which like i say for me that this is a perfect time to be a sneaker lover not just for the hype because i mean pretty much for the most part if you like shoes there's so many shoes for you to buy like you can buy sneakers you can find shoes that you like um like i said i mean i think this is just a cool shoe like i said even with the gray hits on the back there i mean it's just a it's just a good sneaker it's a good sneaker to have it's a good sneaker to have in the collection i'm pretty stoked about it i'm gonna like I'm gonna put it in there with my easy section but yes man here you go you have the easy quantum and the miss slate colorway um Nice breathable. I can't wait to put these to the test. All right, chill out, chill out, chill out. I'm not doing But for real though, before we check up out of here, I got an honorable mention today on the courtesies of wifey. So when I'm telling y'all the most important sneaker, like I said, if you follow me on social media, you know I'm talking about it. You gotta have the house shoes. Yes, she did order me a pair of these Ugg. Uh, Slippers, I don't know the name of these joints is, but they look comfy though. Some Tasman Fleck Knit. So don't bite the style, man. You gotta have a nice house shoe. Your wife came through for these. That's a little cream shoe. I'm you know, saying, give me a couple inches when I'm on camera. Let me slip these bad things on. Yeah, standing tall, you know what I'm saying? I get in, you're not getting these, but no, realistically, though. No. Got a nice little house shoe for today. But before I check up out of here, I definitely wanted to say, man. I'm back. I know it's been a long time since I was getting videos. Out. Videos posted out consistently. Was in the middle of a move. Had to get the room set up. Had to start getting. You know, I feel like I bought some shoes that I was going to record. Then when I was moving, it became like too long ago to record them. But hey, we back now. I want to say we still on that push to 10k. I think somewhere we're like mid 8,000 right now. We still are on the push to 10k. So make sure you subscribe right now. 
hit a like, um, you know, comment, drop a comment down below. Tell me which one of these either you like the most, or if you feel in the house, you like that might be the best sneaker that I show today. I mean, it could be realistic. But yes, man, make sure you leave a subscribe right now. Tap in, man. Share this with your friends, your family, your aunties, your mammies, your daddy. You know what I'm saying? All the people. Anybody that likes sneakers, tell them to come see Moves Alpha. Because, yo, I got a lot of great content coming. The Deion Sanders are finally dropping. And I am going to get out a video of those tomorrow. Because I have them back there from when they dropped a couple months ago, earlier this year. But yes, man, I appreciate y'all for tapping in. Stay tuned. More videos, more sneakers, more shorts, more reviews coming. And, man, listen. I'm out of here. Peace.